Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. This is going to be quite a short video, uh, but what I'm basically going to be doing is flying over this world, the world called Purgatory, uh, that was built by that man over there, the one dressed in the rather scruffy clothes, uh, Mr. Comic1111. And there are a few people that helped him, I think his brother helped him out, and there are uh, one or two other people which I will list in the description, but the vast majority uh, was built by him. And so all we're going to quickly do is see uh, these little corners here, and apparently the Spleef Arena has sort of like different elements, like in each corner, so it's kind of like four, well five Spleef Arenas all in one. So alright, let's go, I need to redeem myself. In the last video, he destroyed me straight away, and oh look, all sort of cactuses underneath, rather than lava, there's all like little cactuses down there and unfortunately it's very laggy i'm sure he should have gone down then look like he was floating over it oh no 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 he's not gonna get me he's not gonna get me oh no like the blocks are disappearing then they're all just reappearing again i think i got no chance of winning here <laughs> come on comic you're not gonna beat me you can't beat mr stampy cat oh i got him in i won we're one all oh there is lava as well there's lava and cacti oh i fell in as well that doesn't count i'd already won right let's go to the other ones there i guess we're one apiece now, so what is there? There's five different ones, so yeah, there is definitely going to be a winner. It can't be a draw, no matter what. We can do a, a, a best of five uh, with these, these spleef arenas. So, there was the middle one, which is like the main one, which is kind of like the, the more traditional spleef arena. And then each corner is supposed to be like a different element. So I guess that one was earth, and this one looks like fire, judging by the pillars of lava that are in the middle. Things just got a little bit dangerous, right? Come on, I can do this. I got this, I can get him. Three, two, one, go! Go, 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 go! Oh, what was this? Oh, oh, does lava come out? Is that, is that what you reckon it does? Is that gonna like spread across it all? I, th I think I'm lagging, so I can't do it. I think I, <laughs> yeah, put it back up again. There we go, make the lava come out. Yeah, look, it spreads out. Ah, oh, this is really cool. I'm actually planning on building a spleef arena in my world so I can uh, take some inspiration from some of these different spleef arenas. It's quite a cool added twist. It will kind of like melt away a load of the ground and it's generally just quite a dangerous thing. And oh no, we're getting so close. I think he's focusing too much on the levers. I'm going after him. I'm going to get him. Oh no, I accidentally smashed the glass. <laughs> don't worry, by the way, he's not saving the game. So uh, don't panic. And oh no, I'm down. I fell in. Oh, there's more cactuses. Okay, so it's 2-1. It's 2-1 to Mr. Comic, so I need to win uh, the next three, no, the next two in order to win, don't I? Okay, so it's, it's not over yet. It's not game over yet, so uh, I've still got a chance. If I win two more, then I will win 3-2. If he wins just one more, then he has won overall. And look at that! I don't think I saw that last video, did I? I'm pretty sure I've not seen that yet. It's like two massive pyramids, like, balanced on their tip. That looks really awesome. And so yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to do these last two corners and uh, then we're going to be heading back to the airport, uh, which you may have seen in one of my last videos, and I will be flying over the world and seeing it from above. And what is... Well, what's, what's this one then? What's the deals with this one? Oh, look at all the dispensers up there. Um... Oh, oh, do they all fire out? Oh, okay, do they like distract you? All right, okay, Komik, are you ready? Oh, what's up here? It's just like a, like a little safety zone or something. There's a bunch of ice you can slide on there. Right, let's go, Comic. Bring it on. Forget the stupid dispensers. Come on, game on, Comic. <laughs> I don't want to knock him while he's not looking. I don't think that'll be fair. I think he's he's doing it. He's focusing too much on the trap. Right, I'm going to get him in. I'm going to get him in. Oh, is he in? Oh, no, he's not on. It's so annoying because of the lag. It's so hard. Like, I keep thinking that he should fall in, then he just about doesn't. Oh, he's, he's really going after the levers. I think that if you're on survival, like... All of the arrows would be like really knocking you back and it would kind of muck you up. But uh, as we are here playing uh, on creative, it kind of just sort of bounces off my fur. And he's gone down. He fell in. I saw you, Comic, don't you? I, thought, I saw you fall down. That's it. We're two all now. It means we've got the decider. We're going to go to the last corner and that will decide the spleefing champion of purgatory. <laughs> well, I hope I get it. If I get it, I'm going to build a little trophy somewhere for me just to say that I won. And uh, if I don't win, then I'm not going to bother building a trophy because I don't care. <laughs> I only care whether I win or not. And here we go, the last one. What element is this going to be then? Like, what, what style's this? Um... What's that? Oh, TNT. Oh, this looks dangerous. Right. I'm going to stand over here, Comic. I don't fancy going in the middle. I think he's waiting for me. Look at it go. Look at it all drop. Is that not just going to knock him down, though? Sure, surely it is. Right. I'm going to stay as far back as I can. 
It's, it's lagging like crazy, so they're not actually blown up. Oh, there they all go. You can see all of the snowballs there popping up. And I think my game is probably going to completely lag out now because of my rubbish British internet connection. <laughs> There's not even any holes in the floor. There it all goes. There's all of the holes appearing now. Right, I want to be careful. I don't, I don't, I don't want Comet to, to teleport near me. Is he going to fall down? Has he dropped in? He looks to be like standing right on it. It's so laggy and glitchy. I definitely want to stay back as far as I can. Is he going to drop? Has he fallen? Has he just killed himself? I'm not entirely sure. No, he's still walking. He seems to be walking on nowhere. Um, is he okay? No, he's down! He blew himself up! <laughs> I won! I managed to win the spleef tournament! Oh, don't, don't bother starting trying to carry on now, Comic. I've already won. I saw you drop down. You can't cheat. Right. Um, let, let us get out of here, then. Is there any way out? Um, I think I might... Do you, do you want to open the door for me? Cheers, mate. Right, I'm going to build myself a little mini trophy down here, then. Because I was able to win. Um, I, I pulled out of gold, of course. And if you want to build a trophy, the easiest way to do it is just... Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. There's my trophy. I managed to win. Ta-da! Stampy, Stampy Cat, the, uh, <laughs> the spleefing champion of purgatory. Yay! 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 Where's my rose gone? Let me get my rose back out again. <laughs> Yay, I actually finally managed to win something. Despite the lag and despite the fact that he was the host, I was actually finally able to win something. Uh, but anyway, uh, I believe... Uh, according to Comic, we have seen pretty much uh, everything that there is in this world. I've not been in that big pyramid yet, though. I don't know if there is actually um, anything in there or whether it's a big, I don't know, an empty thing. But I'm pretty sure I've not been in there. Should I go and investigate it? Uh, I want to make sure that uh, I see everything that's in the world so far before I leave. Uh, but because this world is so massive and uh, he's going to keep adding to it, uh, I'm sure at some point I'm going to come back to this world and uh, see everything that he adds. He's also working on a new world, so... Uh, at some point in the future, if you want, uh, I'll go check that out and have give it a, another little tour and see what uh, Comic has been up to more recently. And I don't think there's anything in here. It's just kind of a massive staircase with a big pit in the middle. It might be a nice place to climb onto, though, just to get a big view. Yeah, look at that. Look at that spleef arena. Oh, that looks absolutely awesome, doesn't it? Look at the size of that thing. That is crazy. I love it, though. <laughs> you can see a few holes in it still from where we've been playing. Right, anyway, to the airport. To the airport. Let, let us go and fly over the world. Right. Uh, I'm going to follow you, Comet, because if I go by myself, I'm probably going to get lost. <laughs> I don't know if we're going to walk the entire way there or if we're going to uh, fly over the world or not. Uh, where are we off to? I think he's looking at the uh, the map himself. Right. Let, let, where are we? I believe it's those um two big massive long buildings. You see like sort of straight ahead of me, those two long fin buildings. I believe that is where the airport is. So uh, we're going to head over there. Hopefully, by the time we get there, it will be night, and uh, then we can have a very quick nap, and so it will be in the day uh, as we go on our cruise over the, the top of the world. We seem to be heading somewhere new, though. Maybe we haven't seen everything yet. He seems to be leading me off into another different direction, like nothing's loaded in where I'm heading, so I'm not sure if I've seen this, this big blue building. You see that on the map? Have I been in there? No, I haven't. It's all just loading in, in now. I guess we hadn't seen everything. There's something new. And uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stand here, and I'm going to let it very slowly appear in front of me. Here it is, all loading in. What is this place? Oh, oh it's all water. Oh, is it a boat thing? Oh, can we ride it? All right, here we go. G give me a nudge, Comic. Push me in. Oh, look, oh there's um, pistons there. There we go. It's pushed me in. I'm going to go really fast, I think. Look at me go. Oh, wow, this is awesome. Oh, look at that up there. This was such a surprise. He told me that I'd seen everything. Look at this. This is awesome. And my boat is sadly broke, but I was very close to the end anyway. Let's go check this thing out. Oh, look at that. I think it's right next to the airport, but last time I was here, it hadn't loaded in yet. Oh, that is absolutely crazy. Look at that symbol up the top there. And is this like another little thing here you can ride your boat down? Oh, I love it. I love this kind of massive thing. It's awesome. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Is it like some sort of cathedral or something? Or like a castle or something like that? I don't know. Oh, it goes all the way around here as well. It's like a, like a big box. 
Ah, oh, this is absolutely amazing. I love stuff like this. This looks so cool. Is there anything down in here? Oh, so it's a big drop. It's a big drop. <laughs> There's a few empty rooms. I guess some of it uh, is a work in progress. Uh, I guess I'm just going to follow Comic round and uh, see what he goes to show me. This was an unexpected treat, though. I'd believed that I'd seen everything there was to see, but uh, this was here just hidden. And look at that there. Was oh, that a massive sword? It kind of does look, it kind of looks like an absolutely massive sword, like, digging into the ground, and there's like a big archway there. Ah, oh, this is amazing, this is so cool. Anyway, I think we have now seen 100% of this world, so uh, I've left no stern, uh, oh, no stern, no stone untoned, uh, unturned, and it's now time uh, for me to go to the airport and take off and fly around the world and see it from the skies, and I'm really looking forward to it. I can't wait to... I see some of this amazing stuff uh, from up above and kind of... I don't know, it's just nice to get that, that other angle. I always like walking around on the floor when I'm doing my tours, but I don't know, it's just something something different about seeing it from up above, you know? Everything just kind of looks a bit bigger and grander. Uh, but anyway, here we go into the airport. Which plane should I go on? Should I go on this little one down here? There's no need to be fancy. There's no need to go into one of those massive ones. I'm going to go on this little cute one down here. It's kind of a bit more of like a, a helicopter rather than an aeroplane with the way the propellers are. Right, I'm going to have to quickly break my way in. And I'm going to shove down a few beds down here uh, so I can have a quick nap. And then it's time to go and fly over the world. Uh, yeah, I, I might have to um, break the uh, the front of the plane a little bit just because uh, there doesn't seem to be much of a big window. I might have to add some glass in or something there just so uh, I can see everything. So uh, I can get rid of my bed, uh, try and get through. <laughs> Me and Comic seem to be kind of stuck in each other there in the corner. Uh, yeah, there's not, not much of a view. I don't want to fly around like this. If I break this, and don't worry, uh, he's not saving the game. So don't worry, I'm not griefing or anything like that but here we go this is going to be my view for the tour so i want to thank you very much comic for flying around and uh i will see you all later bye